Good evening, everyone. Giving an honor to God and my divine family. This is the Clarity Flamboyant. And I want to talk to you this evening about the word animosity. We live in a very competitive society that throws challenges to their competition to stop them from being able to come and show them up So these silent duelers battles you behind the scenes with animosity for your talents. So they try to discredit people by gossip and lies to cutthroat their competitor. As we all grow up, we notice that our loved ones can be just the people that have so much animosity for us than the strangers in the street they warn us of that's supposed to be a threat to us but are usually more accepting and inviting unlike our blood-related loved ones for some. Some of our upbringings had so much animosity in it from our parents and loved ones because the other parent was negligent and a deadbeat for some. So the remaining parent, usually the mom, takes this out on the children. Mainly, men need to hear this because while you're watering bird seeds all over the universe, The karmic moms you leave us with take it out all of their anger on the kids. This animosity is why we have so many missing or dead children. Because the angry parent kills or allow someone to abuse their kids which is usually the next man they are swindling to better entice them to stay. They gave them the guy rights to your kids who in return get beat, raped, even murdered for some. But you men don't take the time to check on your kid with them and they know it. If you stay away from the baby mom with so much animosity because of the reckless behavior they engage in trying to hurt, even kill you and destroy your property, what makes you think that your kids are safe with the same person in that energy, obviously You guys think because they are our blood parents, we're safe, but you're wrong. Men, be more responsible during sex because kids don't ask you to make them. So you can't have animosity when told you have a kid or one on the way because you refuse to put on a condom. To feel the real deal. But the kids you are producing don't get the real childhood experience for the nut you chose to crack. But the kids are the ones being left behind with the nutcracker that's off their rockers. Thanks to all my subscribers, my viewers, to everyone that donates and supports my channel. As always, God bless and much love to you, my brothers and sisters. Please pay attention, people, to your children. Enjoy the rest of your day.